think about that that hidden tribes report um you know it was it was it was cool to see a lot of the frustrated middle there it, it looked like and it was it was kind of uplifting i mean i know the country is polarized but mm -hmm. you got this, i got the real sense that this polarization is kind of a mile wide and an inch deep and that there might be a way to break through yeah. uh, my sense is that a lot of that frustrated middle from the hidden tribes model actually came out and voted this time where they hadn't in the past yeah maybe it's like yeah the frustration but still much more open-minded than than we might give them credit for or yeah yeah so that's 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 a i guess yeah reassuring exciting kind of <laughs> development yeah, it was like a code it was like being in a totally different environment a totally different universe than what you see uh, if you read newspapers or listen to cable tv or if you're on social media this it seemed like almost like a completely different america yeah yeah i think our our biggest conflict which is it's not even to say that it was a conflict was someone who was still outside in line and had uh make america great again mask and hat on and we had one of our workers ask him you know you're not going to be able to wear that within the within the poll within the precinct um so we have we have masks to offer you to replace it and just you know ask that you take the hat off um and he he was being a little bit obstinate and actually got us to 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 start up the the process for treating him as a curbside voter because he just didn't want to come in and by the time we gather our team up got all the all the supplies to go out to him he he decided he would he would comply so yeah, we had it's we just, had yeah. we had two guys that were eh, they were a little short of obstinate. I, I think they were grumpy about asking him to. And one guy had a balaclava on. I just you know somebody had a problem with it and came in and got me. And I said, you, you, I'd like to ask you, could could you just pull up your balaclava just for everybody else around here? And he gave me the eye roll and all, but he pulled it up. And it was I think kind of being in the middle of people. Yeah, yeah, got him to comply. And that goes again a little bit to your point of, of just the community aspect of, I mean, it's, yeah. you know, we're, we're in a pandemic, we're, you know, doing social distancing to, to differing degrees, depending on where you are, but having everyone in that place for that purpose and, and knowing that the people who are working the poll site are there to, to facilitate that. It seemed like there was, yeah, that, that kind of shared energy, that spirit of like, just understanding yeah. that we're all part of this process that is is so fundamental and core to the country that we're in. Bye.